instant deliciousness. Hello everybody, how are you doing today? So after last week's video was a little bit serious, I thought today was time for a bit more of a fun topic and what is more fun than unpacking a food box? So today here is me, a German, unpacking Munch Pack. So Munch Pack sends you snacks from all around the world and I found that a very suitable topic. So let's all unite and let's try some international snacks. So to start with, I do love the packaging. It's a very diverse collection of people on here so you've got all types of people my favorite is definitely the alien down here thank you so much munch pack for sending this to me um nothing i find this so exciting whoa there's a little card it says followers on snapchat and this is made with love by chris thank you chris and yeah i'll put all the links down below so you can follow these guys on snapchat and you know everything that you need to know so all the links are going to be down below I love this, so like sophisticated. Where? Oh my God. What? This is called Big Bars. I wish I could read to you what it says, but I cannot. So I know there's something in English, chocolate cracker. What? What is this shape even? Oh my God, oh my God. It's instantly delicious. Instant deliciousness. Oh my, oh I love this. Instant food gasm bar. That's what it should be called. Oh my god. Mm. If it continues like that, awesome. Really? Pirate's booty. And it says, and I'm not joking, aged white cheddar. So old, old cheese. I'm not a fan of cheese balls. And I'm. I thought it would smell like this, right? Cheese balls. Cheese balls never smell good, do they? Okay, let's do this. No. <laughs> what is this? Squinkled? Where is this from? What is this even? Squ squinkles. Squinkles. It's called squinkles. I think it's Mexican. Tira de dulce enchilado. Sabor piña con relleno sabor tamarindo. Do you understand what I just read out? Let me know. Ooh, what is that? It looks like a dog treat. <laughs> I don't want it. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> no. What? Weird. <laughs> oh my god. Ruffles Mega Crunch. Cool dude. And Mega Crunchy. Apparently so. Where's this from? It says something in Spanish, so I think it must be from a Spanish country, Spanish-speaking country. Yeah. Yeah. Jalapeno, jalapeno, jalapeno. How do you pronounce this? Let me know. Oh, very spicy. They should be called Mega Spice, but they are delicious. I was going to say, oh, look, there's Belgian waffles, but then, no, it's not Belgian waffles. It says, be my soul mate, be my waffle mate. Do you want to be my waffle mate? I definitely want to be your waffle mate. These are called Lotte. They are from Korea. Waffles for waffle friends from Korea. Let's try some waffles. Woo. They come in little packs. Mmm. Mmm. Very mild. Not too much in your face. Definitely missing some coffee. Don't really change your life. Let's put it like that. So here we have some peanuts crunch snack. They are called Mat Dong San and they are apparently from Korea as well. I love the little packaging, can you see? They don't look too nice. <laughs> yeah, not really my taste. Peanutty, but also doesn't change my life. Oh, what is this even? <laughs> Jabalinia. What is this? It looks like a sausage, it's not. It's from Mexico, again, and it doesn't have any description. A weird thing on a stick. Thank you, Mexico. I hope if you're from Mexico, please leave a comment below. This is awesome. But I'm not sure if this is awesome. Oh my god. What is it made of? This is oh no, if the, the early the earlier one didn't taste like a dog treat. And it's so spicy, so I think the outside is chili. Oh my god, this is not for me. Oh, this looks like cereal for children. So it's some sort of rice thing from Ukraine. Okay, so a little rice puff thingy from Ukraine. 
sweet rice clusters. Maybe you're supposed to have this with milk. I don't know. Let's try. For those of you who, who know Smacks, the cereal, it tastes like that, but all kind of sticking together. Interesting, interesting. Here's another thing from Mexico. I am now a bit wary because the first two were in two grade. This one looks like a sort of a really hardcore kind of nut bar. It's sticking together my teeth. Palanqueta. Lucas, pick Lucas enchiladas. Is this again from Mexico? <laughs> Where is this from? Yep, Mexico. Very interesting. Ooh, little tiny red balls. Mmm, I like these. Thank you. They're like better Skittles. I like these. Thanks, guys. Woohoo! Just to leave the most mysterious one for last, this little black writing that you can see is all there is. There's no writing on the back. There's nothing else. So let me show you. And if you can read this, leave a comment below if you know what it means. So if you want to pause the picture, leave a comment if you can read this. I'm going to be totally brave and try the mysterious thing. Mm. It's a bit like a prawn cracker. You know prawn crackers that you get at the Chinese place? Mm, I like this. So the funniest thing is that my favorite was definitely the thing I tried first. So the big bar, the instant food gazan bar, was my favorite thing. Thank you for this, guys. But thank you for the whole box. This was so much fun. This is literally exactly what I wanted. Like I said, after last week being a bit more sad, right now there's a bit more of an interesting type of video, you know, with a lot of international flavors. So thank you, Munch Pack, for sending this to me so much. I leave a co comment, link down below, like I said, where you guys can check Munch Pack out. If you want to have an international surprise, I definitely recommend it. It was so much fun. Um, and yeah. Thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you want to see new videos every week. I do make new videos every Thursday and sometimes more than that. And please follow me on Instagram and Snapchat if you want to see a bit more of my daily life. And that's it. I am going to finish eating my big bar and I'll see you next week. Thank you and goodbye.